Hello my fellow miner, today we'll have a look at NP Miner version 40.1 in HiveOS. We'll have a look at the RTX 3060 version 2 LHR, the RTX 3060 Ti LHR, the RTX 3070 LHR, the RTX 3070 Ti, the RTX 3080 LHR and the RTX 3080 Ti. Let's have a look at the core clock settings for the RTX 3060. LHR. I lock the core clock to 15.52 and set the memory clock to 2600. That is 1300 in Windows. You can see the NB settings here for Windows. Now let's have a look at the Ethereum mining overclock settings for the RTX 3060 Ti LHR. I lock the core clock to 1350 and the memory clock to 2100. In Windows that is 1050. All the fans are set to run at 80%. Now let's have a look at the LHR overclock settings for the 3070 LHR. I locked the core clock at 11.25 and set the memory clock to 2600 which is 1300 in Windows. As you can see all my cards are running quite cool. Now it's time to have a look at the Ethereum overclock settings for the RTX 3070 Ti. I locked the core clock to 930 and set the memory to 2300. In Windows that is 1150. Now let's have a look at the overclock settings for the RTX 3080 LHR. I locked the core clock to 1500 and the memory clock to 3400. Unfortunately you cannot see the memory temperature in HiveOS but I have a dual boot on this so in Windows it's around 86 degrees Celsius. If you're interested in seeing an in-depth test of the RTX 3080, click the card above. Now it's time to have a look at the overclock clock settings for the RTX 3080 Ti. I lock the core clock to 1500 and set the memory clock to 2600 which is 1300 in Windows. The memory is around 84 to 86 degrees Celsius in Windows. Let's have a look at the average result and compare it to previous results. First up is the RTX 3060 LHR version 2, 36 mega hash per second at 104 watts which gives an efficiency of 0 0.346. Let's have a look at the RTX 3060 Ti, 43.8 mega hash per second at 124 watts which gives an efficiency of 0 0.353. Moving on to the RTX 3070 LHR. 45.4 mega hash per second at 111 watts which gives an efficiency of 0 0.409. Now it's time for my favorite DIY card, the RTX 3070 Ti. 57.8 mega hash per second at 182 watts which gives an efficiency of 0 0.318. Now it's time to look at the RTX 3080 hash rate. 76.6 mega hash per second at 242 watts which gives an efficiency of 0 0.317. It's time to have a look at the last card, the RTX 3080 Ti hash rates. 86.3 mega hash per second at 265 watts which gives an efficiency of 0 0.326. Here we can see how it compares to Lot Miner version 1.37, which is not the latest version. The latest version is 1.38, which I will be testing later today and most likely releasing tomorrow. Tomorrow being the 5th of December, so if it's the 5th of December or past the 5th of December, check my channel for the video. Now let's compare it to G Miner, T Rex Miner, and an earlier version of NB Miner in Windows 10. If you like the video, please click like. If you want to see more, please subscribe. I'll leave you with this comparison. Have a nice weekend. See you in the next one.